Hello, this is Darren uh, coming at you with yet another video. Uh, right here, I've got a Rubik's cube. This is one of the few things I can do that you know some people might be uh, impressed by. I I, I I can solve a Rubik's cube. Uh, so I thought I'd just document it. Uh, I don't. I don't use this camera that much, you know, just sitting there, might as well make a video. Here we go. Now there are a lot of fancy ways to do this. Um, I do it in a pretty simple way. So first I try to solve one layer of the cube. So I'm going to start with the white layer. All right. Uh, the first layer is, is pretty simple, you know, just anybody can figure it out if they just uh, mess around with the cube enough. As, as you can see, it's, uh, you know, it's coming into shape. Uh, yeah, not, not that much, not that much I can say about, you know, solving the top layer. Um, let's see. almost there so as you can see the top layer is done uh, one thing I want to note is that uh, uh, the color on each side matches the, the middle piece um, that's the case with all sides so then the second layer then just becomes four pieces like this 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 and this and there's a pretty set way you can just stick those pieces in there. It's not overly complicated. You see this piece is now in place. Uh, wow, this cube is... We've got another piece in place. have one more. Oh, ah, I messed up. <laughs> so it's, it's, it's here, but it's backwards. It's my bad. Uh, let's see. Oops, 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 oops. Uh, ah, I'm making this way harder than it needs to be. But all these movements are, are, are quite simple. Uh, you can find all of them on the internet. So now, now we're down to this bottom layer. This bottom layer is actually where I would say 80% of the work comes in. So the first thing I want to do is solve this cross. So I want this entire cross to be blue. And there's just a simple little twisting move that will accomplish that. I think this will accomplish it. Yes, and it does. So then the next thing I want to do is is make these four pieces line up. So right now, one of them is already lined up, this red piece. I want to line up these other three. And there's also a fairly simple move that we can do, I believe. Sometimes I mess one of these up and I just have to do it twice. Ah, great. So now, we got lucky this time. All these corner pieces are almost solved. So I'm just gonna go ahead and solve it. See this corner is here. And the bottom is messed up right now, but when I solve this corner, it'll just happen. Everything will just fall into place. And 
there we have it.